Happening this hour near the United Nations, a gathering to mark 100 days of captivity for hostages being held by Hamas in Gaza. Those who attend today's rally will hear from the families of hostages, along with a 13-year-old girl who was held in Gaza for 50 days. CBS 2's Elijah Westbrook is live on the east side. Elijah? That's right. Good morning, Cindy. Just bear with us as it's very loud right now. But there are hundreds of people here on 47th Street between 1st and 2nd Avenue as we speak, showing their support for the release of these hundreds of hostages who are being held by Hamas. So we know that Governor Kathy Hochul will also be here shortly to show her support and make remarks about what's currently happening overseas. Now, take a look. Uh, we've been here all morning and watched as organizers brought out post Posters and signage calling on the attention of American leaders to help free these hostages and bring them home. Uh, we know one of the people, Cindy, you just mentioned, is a 13-year-old girl. Her name is Hila Shoshani. Uh, you may remember her story sent shockwaves around the world as she was in captivity for 50 days in Gaza. Uh, this group's organizers spoke with us moments ago about that and why raising awareness about this issue is so important to them. For us, the international community should step up. Um, these people were taken away on their pajamas from their beds. They've done nothing wrong to anyone, um, and they're under a terror organization, a, sad, a sadistic terror organization that is threatening their lives daily. And we're being told by she and other organizers that family members of hostages flew into New York this week. Uh, escorting the families is Yaden Gelman, a soldier in the IDF Special Forces who was seriously wounded in battle on October 7th. Feel free to take us back out here live. I mean, Cindy, would you look at this? There are hundreds of people right now. This is 47th Street between 1st and 2nd Avenue. Uh, momentarily, we know that Governor Kathy Hochul will be speaking, showing her support support amid all of this. But for now, we are live on Manhattan's east side. Elijah Westbrook, let's send it back to you. Elijah,